bring this bring this into our relationships. I mean, it, and it, it naturally comes into our relationships because this is what we're discovering in our lives. You can't mm -hmm. keep it out. I mean, but when you really start to look at, I mean, just in my own relationship, not only with my partner but with my father and my business associates, associates, all of that, um, it does it does change that stuff. Yeah. I mean, yeah. Mm -hmm. Kind of infuses it with some deeper value of life. Yeah. Um, I think you're more tuned into the neo Advaita world than I am, and I hope that term is not an insult. Um, but you know what I mean. I mean all the Jeff Foster and all these people that are out there teaching. Um, and earlier on in, the, in this uh, talk, you alluded to the fact that a lot of people seem to have moved out of uh, a more fundamentalist stage, uh, as you have, and um, kind of come to embrace a more holistic view of life, you know, including both absolute and relative. I mean, is that fair to say? I mean, is, is there a general trend among the so-called neo-advaita world uh, toward that? Or, or are a lot of people just as ensconced in that absolutist view as ever? Uh, I mean, if someone like Jeff, if you talk to Jeff, he very much these days tries to meet people where they are. I think he's got, the, the for example, the reputation of sort of being neo advaita but it was never anything that he would call himself. Uh -huh. I think he's gone through a sort of an evolution in the way that I have. I think that, I think it's real easy to kind of have real absolutistic thinking in this. I think it's just something that happens because in one way you sort, you really do see that you know, separation really isn't real, that it isn't what we thought it was. And so that can be such, leave such an imprint in the mind, yeah. you know, that it's, a, that it's the mind where it's leaving an imprint. It's leaving it in, in, as a thought. And it, therefore, if it's a thought, it's, it, it has the possibility of becoming absolutistic, you know, mm -hmm. like. And so I think that Jeff has gone through.